What's up, you guys? WWE fan 0599 here again, and today we're going to review episode 11 of season 3 of Arrow. And this episode is entitled Midnight City. So, uh, before we start this review, spoilers are ahead. So, if you have not seen this episode, do not watch this review. So what this episode is basically about, it's about um, the main villain, I already forgot his name, but he captures three, um, three congressmen, and now it's up to the Arrow team to try and stop him from capturing these guys. So what did I think of episode 11? Pretty good episode, I really enjoyed episode 11, this was a great episode episode in my opinion it really was so let's get into my positives and my positives are characters were great in this episode much better than they were in last week's episode you know um roy roy was great he really is he's he's coming in his own in really in these episodes you know ever since oliver's been gone he's been really coming on his own and it's great to see you know so i really liked roy in this episode diggle's always great and felicity she redeems herself from last week's episode, so thank thank goodness that happened. You know, she redeemed herself from last week's episode. Um, you know, Roy Palmer, Brandon Ralph as Roy Palmer, he's always great. I cannot believe I'm actually going to say this, but I actually like Laurel in this episode. I know, right? Like, how did it happen? I actually liked her in this episode. I thought it was going to be a bad idea at first. I was like, I'm not going to like this at all, but I'm kind, I will, I, 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 I'll go, I will get used to this, you know? I will get to used to seeing Laurel as the Black Canary, and, you know, I think it's pretty cool so far. Who knows, I might start to like her character now. We'll see, we'll see if she doesn't. Be as annoying as she was in the first two seasons and half of season three. We'll see, okay? I might actually like Laurel. The action was great in this episode. It really was. It, uh, it, the action's always great in these episodes. I thought the flashbacks were great, you know. We see that, I forgot his name, but he. you see that he'll do anything to get his wife back. That, w that means even risking thousands of lives to get his wife back, you know. I did like... Seeing um, Oliver in the present day communicating with them because, you know, they brought him back to life. I, I'm interested to see because apparently they're not in a relationship now, those two. So I'm, I'm interested to see what happens to them. Maybe their son dies. Who knows? Who knows their son kind of like got killed in the um, flashbacks. Who knows? You know, maybe that's why. But we'll see, I guess. It, they're no longer in a relationship. This was going to be a negative. I'm going to be completely honest. Now, you know the DJ thing I did not like from episode 7, I believe? Yeah, to bring him back, and he's all like, yeah, yeah. I'm, and, they, and it was trying, I felt like it was going to be a forced relationship thing. But no, it actually fits into the plot, because at the end of the episode, we see that he's working for the League of Assassins. I was like, did not see that coming. That's awesome, okay? You just turn a negative into a positive right there. I like the fact that that happened. Nice twist. My only negative with this episode has got to be the fact that Lowell is still keeping this secret from his father that her sister's dead. That That's the only thing. Uh, why, like, why are you still keeping this a secret? I mean, tell him already. It's just I did not like that. That was the only thing I did not like about this episode. Everything else was great about this episode. So it's time for my official grade on episode 11. And my official grade on episode 11 is an A. Great episode. I really enjoyed this episode. Cannot wait for next week's episode. He's coming back. He's got family to feed. Yeah. Alright, so what did you guys think of this episode? Leave it in the comment section below. I'm WWE Fan 0599 and we will see you all later. Peace.